This is messy play activity for after school. So you've got some bubbles there. Okay. With the bubble gun. And um, that's for an older child. Younger children, you'd use bubble machine. Okay. And then you've got some water there. Because it's cold, getting cold now, um, you would use lukewarm water okay for their water play so and then you put it um you put some water toys in there okay and they can play filling and emptying and they can do colors okay if you've got a bigger tub of course um you can do bigger tub but if you've got a small tub like this one you do a small tub okay and um then you've got a sand pit okay now this is a sand tray so you can see it there I'm still in the middle of setting up okay so you put sand toys okay and again they can do um wet sand you know you can wet the sand for them and they can do wet sand um, or dry sand and you put some toys in there they'll play with the different toys so you've got um, different types of transport you've got spades in there you've got rake in there you've got sand wheel in there okay and you've got a sieve in there you've got some sand molds to make castle um, and different figures in there and then you've got um, and then we've also put some building blocks in there depending on what kind of a child you have um, you'll put what they're interested in so this particular child likes to build a lot of things um, they also like cars and different types of transport they like water of course and they like um they like you know different colors and they also like action activities you know like this is basically a boy boys um play play um set up but girls can also play with it so if he had a friend over he'd um who's a girl um she'll be able to play you know so yeah so if they're siblings you can mix it up older child with a younger child that's why we've got spade we've got big spades and small spades we've got pinks we've got um we've got another water toy in there so they can always put water in there and splash as well and one person can be playing in the sand with another person and then another person can be playing with the bubble gun with another person and then two other people can be playing in the water okay or they can be playing in the water by themselves okay so it's a great group activity and then you can put something on the side as well um, for them to play with that is not messy so they can come play and then they go and chill for the rest of the evening doing other things and um that's that's basically it